Only uh, only five practices, but what are your, your takeaways from spring ball so far? I mean, so far the team, you know, uh, it's a different um, tempo. It's a different, uh, everybody's acting different now. Every, you know, it's not now, it's just not the seniors leading the team. It's young dudes showing the seniors too. And then the defense, with the new defense coaches, all the, all the defensive players, they moving around and, you know, they doing everything. They get into the ball, you know, no lows. So and the same with the offense. So it's looking real good. Coaches? kept saying that he's really stressing fundamentals. How noticeable yeah. is that and how important is that to you guys? I mean, it's very noticeable. You know, uh, we will we'll put extra periods during the practice just so we can, you know, stop and walk through everything and make sure the linemen are doing their correct steps and not crossing over on plays and making sure the receivers are getting their exact depth, walking through stuff for, you know, 10 minutes just, just to go over everything and keep it, keep it like, keep putting it in everybody's mind. And then we got, you know, it's young dudes. We moved Cam Denson, the receiver, so... You know, we got to teach him. He's, he's, I mean, he's an athlete. He's a free athlete. He's real good. Rich mentioned uh, injuries being an issue about why you're a little inconsistent last season. He thought you were never healthy. How's your health now? And is that frustrating at times? Yeah, but I mean, I'm not gonna lie. I mean, it's still the same. But yes, I mean, it's either it's either I keep nagging and taking and being soft on it and babying it, or just go out there and play ball and that's what I'm gonna do. So whatever happens, happens. I mean, I'm not too worried about the bad stuff. I just want to play and I'm tired of not being able to play to my full ability. So I just I just come out here and practice now. You mentioned uh, Cam on offense. How, how's he been so far? Uh, he's been real good. You know, he's still learning, you know, simple fundamentals. It's like, you know, the releases. But when it comes down to going to go get the ball, you know, he'll go get it like today. I mean, right on the pylon, one hand, snag in the air, kept his toes in, good focus. So, I mean, I, I think he's going to be real good for us. How important is it for you guys to have a, a bigger receiver with Caleb Don, Trey's the biggest guy? Is that important? I, I personally don't think so. I mean, yeah, Caleb was a big help, but, I mean, it doesn't really make a difference. I mean, even the little guys, some of the little guys can do the same thing he was doing that we just, they just never tried it with us. But, I mean, I don't think it, I mean, Cam, he has like a 36 inch vertical, so he's about six foot, so he can get up there too. Trey has a 34 inch, 35 inch vertical. He's 6'4, 6'3. He can go up and get the ball. So, I mean, I don't think, I don't think it'll be a problem with this year. Even though you're an offense, do you notice a, a difference with the new defensive coaches? Any impressions? You've, you've yeah, they, I mean, they, they're, they're fun. And then on top of that, they're they're serious. And, and players like you know, a player don't want to just listen to a coach scream, you know. And some coach can say, oh, you need to do this, and you know, not be able to show them exactly how you want to die. Like the DB coach, coach, the linebacker coach, that you know, they're able to teach everything, and while they're teaching, they're having fun, but making everybody go hard. I mean, I see them over there running back and forth, back and forth, like how we did, how we do as receivers. And, and I mean, that's a good thing because now they all. We throw the ball, we throw a sight. We got the cornerback from all the way over there on the opposite side getting the screenplay. So, I mean, it's just real good. Who's, who's a new receiver that's maybe catching your eye a little bit or that's taking the sound pretty quickly? Um, I mean, Cam's really kind of like the only new receiver in, uh, I mean, Donovan, but he, you know, he hasn't been running with the, the ones and twos yet. But uh, Tony Ellison, I keep trying to tell people he's going. He's going to be the next Edelman. There's a lot of talk of him going into last year too. What's kind of yeah, what's, for sure. What's I'm kind of sure. he worked about on since then? Wait, what you say? What what has he kind of improved on since last year? Uh, he he's I mean he, he his route running and everything's getting better. But Tony, since Tony got here, he's always been you know like a kid who can just watch somebody do something and learn it. And his route since he got here, he's been one of the best route runners we had. So I mean. He, I have a, it's a 99% chance in my mind that he's going to end up starting at one point in the season. Because he's real good. He can catch. His release moves are clean. He go gets the ball. He's physical. And, I mean, he's an overall good receiver. Do you feel a personal responsibility to take on more leadership this year? Uh, yes, definitely. Because, <clears throat> I mean, sometimes, you know, it's fun to joke around. But, if, like, coaches always say, like, you know, all right, do this correctly. The young dude's going to look at you. And I never, like, looked at it like that. But like they actually do look at us, so now we try to take everything more serious and, and be more focused. And you can see them being real focused. Like it's no playing around in the meetings. You, I mean, we might laugh here and there, or something funny happen. And once they see an older dude stop laughing, or older dude be like, "All right, y'all, let's go." Everybody get silent and get back to the film. Is it more serious this year than it has been in the past? Yeah. It's, it's, it's way more serious. It's, I mean, it's real intense too. I mean, Coach Roddy, he's not playing this year. 
<laughs> ain't nobody gonna try at me either, so right. <laughs> everybody's just focused. So I think we'll be good. Why do you think that is? Why do you think he's gonna be Because um, I just feel like, you know, Coach, he wants to have fun with us, but at times we take it too far. And, and when he gets serious, like, you know, we all know he's serious, but I mean, we're still, you know, playing around and just being, you know, what you want to call it, this young man. And I mean, as we've seen our results last year, no matter how many players we got injured last year, like that was no excuse for the way our season was. So now, I mean, we all, we all realize what what being focused could do for our team and how it can ruin our whole season. So I mean, we, we, he ain't playing this year, and we're not gonna play either. How important or valuable is it to have those bigger-bodied receivers? You 